Hello everyone, this is Luke and welcome back to Gaming Instincts TV and our How to Slay series for Monster Hunter World. Title Update 2.0 has officially launched, and with it comes one of the most ferocious monsters hunters have ever seen in the franchise. In the jungles of the ancient forest, the deadly brute wyvern Devilio appears in the new world. Toppling this beast is no small task. It is deceptively fast for its size and uses its bulk to its advantage, attacking with ferocious charges. This monster is always looking for a fight, so let's take a look at some tips and tricks to tackle it head on. While being weak to the dragon element itself, Devilio has a unique attack that occurs when the monster is enraged. When it begins to glow red all over its body, the monster will eventually have to discharge the energy it has stored in the form of a massive dark cloud of gas. Watch for the monster to pull its head all the way to the right, where it will begin to breathe out the gas in a massive arc all the way around the area in front of it. This attack has a massive range on it, so do everything possible to get behind the monster's head to avoid the large damage area. If hit by this attack, the hunter will suffer immediate damage and a large knockback, as well as possibly being afflicted with Dragon Blight. When afflicted with the Dragon Blight, all elemental effects on the hunter's weapon are nullified, and the weapon will only do base damage. Eating a Nullberry will remove the debuff, so make sure to carry a stack of them along for this hunt. While Delio does not have many unique basic attacks, its attacks do a massive amount of damage that can easily two-shot a hunter even while buffed from pre-hunt meals. The monster has a set of massive jaws that it will use to bite as its prey, lifting them up in the air and tossing them across the map. When smaller monsters are present, such as Great Jagras, Devilio will pick them up in its massive jaws and begin to use them as a weapon, swinging them around and slamming them into the ground. While it can create a much needed distraction for hunters to rebuff or heal themselves, make sure to get clear of the monsters so not to be crushed by these attacks. Devilio is much faster than its size suggests, and can clear areas in the map quickly using its monstrous size to knock anything in its path out of the way. There are three distinct ways that the monster will charge. First, it will put down its head and swing it left to right while moving forward several times, covering distance and changing up direction based on where the target is mid-charge. Second, Devilio will move towards its target, slamming its head into the ground and then pulling it out violently after a moment, flinging debris around it. Last, the monster will charge in a similar way, moving its head back and forth, but moving forward faster, then lay its head onto the ground while charging and dragging its head forward to knock away its target while continuing to attack. All three of these variations can be handled in a similar way. Keep an eye on the monster's trajectory and keep as mobile as possible dodging around the monster. Maintain a close distance to the back of the monster, but far enough away that the hunter cannot be trampled by Devilio's legs while it is charging. There are not many areas that are safe from damage due to the monster's ability to change directions on a dime and connecting with most parts of its body, even during a standstill attack, can send the hunter flying. When fighting this monster, it's best to stay moving as much as possible, especially early on in the fight, to wear it out. Once it's tired, the monster will begin to slow down and take breaks more frequently, which is the opening to attack. Having a weapon with range is very handy to take to the battle to help maintain a safe distance while still maintaining steady DPS. Devilio has two major weak points, its head and its stomach. These two points are both breakable and its tail can be cut off over time. The monster takes heavy damage from both dragon and water elemental attacks, and medium level damage from fire and water. This monster has a ton of health, so make sure to carry a stack of null berries into this fight to remove dragon blight when afflicted to get full damage out of elemental attacks. Devilio is also affected equally across the board by all ailments that can be caused, so take along any kind of traps and bombs possible into battle to get that extra leg up on the monster. This fight is brutal. Devilio's hitboxes are huge and its attacks do a massive amount of damage from all angles. This hunt can be frustrating, but stick to the grind and wear the monster down. It will eventually tire it out and the advantage will be in your hands. Devilio parts can be used to forge an awesome set of armor with great base defense and ice resistance. It can also be used to forge one of any of the 14 weapons in the game with high dragon elemental damage and a high chance for causing Elder Seal, very useful for taking down Elder Dragons. Hopefully these tips and tricks will help guide hunters on taking down this ferocious wyvern. And there you have it. Gaming Instincts TV will be leaving you right here. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video, and hit that notification bell to stay up to date and know when a new video is ready for your viewing pleasure. Also, check out our official website at GamingInstincts.com for latest daily news, featured articles, reviews, and more. Peace out everybody.